Hello class, this is Dr. Fenton. In this video, I'm going to show you quickly how to access your textbook through Redshell. So let's get started, and I'll remove my uh, screen out of the way. After you set up your Redshell account so you can access your textbook, then when you log back in, this is the screen you should see. So I'm going to log in into my account, and then uh, any other uh, Redshell textbooks you have will be listed down here. So here, let's go to Start Reading, and it'll load up, and here it comes. So I'm already you know, here at Chapter 1. What you can do to move around through the textbook, let's go through here, Table of Contents, and I'm going to go back to the, uh, to, to the cover. So when you first access the book, this might be what you see, this screen right here. All right, so from here, you can either go from page to page as you are turning the pages in the hardbound textbook. And this will take a while to get through all the front material. So go to the contents over here, table of contents. If you want to go to the first chapter, go to part one. Expand that, click chapter one, and here we are back to chapter one. So from this point, you can get rid of this, get the full screen. And then you can zoom in if you need to, depending on how small your computer screen is, or zoom out if you want to, get it all on one page. This is a little bit too small for me, so I'm going to zoom in a little bit, probably about right here. So from this point on, you can scroll down on each page, go page to page, and read everything. So that should be about it. Now, one thing I've noticed is, uh, let's say you, you uh, want to highlight something. So what you can do if you'd like to highlight something is, first of all, highlight it with this. We've got a little too much there. Let's start here. Highlight, let's see this paragraph, down to here. And then your highlight uh, button should appear. So if you highlight it in yellow, just click, and there it is. So when you come back to this page later, let's go forward a couple pages, and come back. There you have the highlighted portion. And then if you want to really get creative and use different colors, right here, you can use green if you want to for this one. Okay. And if you want to get rid of highlights, come back to here, click, delete, and the highlight is gone. So that's about it. Uh, just go like you were turning the pages, page to page here. And that's all there is to it. So good luck with your studies.